Hey everyone, Jason from Conex International. Today we're going to be talking about our couplers, we're going to be talking about our comfits, our direct berries, and our microfit couplers. So let's go ahead and get started. Well, these are our comfit couplers. They've been in our lineup now for a while and they've proven themselves to be very successful in the marketplace. There's a few things I want to go through with you on them. The first is how to get the coupler onto the duct. Now, the first thing we need to re remember is that this is a push fit coupler. And what that means is you don't need to twist it out or unscrew it in order to successfully get the duct in there. And if you do that and you tighten it up, it doesn't mean you're gonna get any tighter of a fit, okay? So you just leave it like this, right? And so uh, what you wanna do is you wanna take the duct and the coupler and put them together. Now. The, a lot of times when you initially start to put the duct into the, it, into the coupler, um, you give it a good push and you hit a stopping point, right? Now, most people, some people, will stop there and say, I've got my fit, I'm good to go, right? The reality is, is you need to push it a little bit further. The reason why? All you've done is push past the bite ring. Now, the bite ring is very important because it keeps the coupler from coming off. Right? And each of these couplers uh, carry a range of, of max pull force that will keep the duct from coming out of the coupler. For example, our three quarter inch is 832 pounds of pressure on this little thing it's going to require to get it to get that duct to come off. On the two inch, on the other hand, you're going to require over 1300 pounds of pressure to be able to just pull it apart. So that bite ring is very important. Okay? But you haven't, you haven't successfully put the duct into the coupler. You need to push it a little bit more. Okay, and what, I, and what I mean is like this, you just give it another push and you see it drops in just a little bit more. The reason why is although you've hit the bite ring, you haven't gone through the rubber seal and that, that is what holds all your water pressure in and keep, or air pressure in and keeps the water out, right? So let's take it apart and take a look. Okay, so we've taken it apart and the one thing is that on the very inside of the coupler, there is another a stopping ring in there. It's molded into place so that when you've actually gone all the way through, it will stop the duct from sliding all the way through the coupler, okay? Now if we pull this back, we see that we're past, we're past the rubber seal. So now we're going to get an airtight and a watertight seal. We've got a little spacer. And now we've got our bite ring. Now, if we, uh, if we, use, if we have to take the duct off of the coupler, we, uh, we are more than likely going to have to take this apart. Again, that bite ring is there to grab hard, so you can't just pull it off. So, but now you've got your bite ring. You can take that off, and uh, you're good to go. So that's how you put the, the coupler onto the duct. All right, so now we're going to talk about our direct berry and our microfit couplers. So the microfit couplers have been in our lineup for a while now and they have been a great all-purpose coupler, and people still use them for indoor and outdoor applications. But we've really tried to steer this more towards indoor applications, data centers, warehouses, those sorts of things. And the reason why is this. When you go to put the coupler onto the duct, it holds very, very nicely. It uses a bite ring, but that bite ring is metal. And we wanted to make sure that if you're using these in the field, that you could get no deterioration in the coupler, right? And we don't want that any water getting in there and possibly compromising the, uh, compromising the coupler. So we've tried to turn this into more of an indoor application coupler. The nice thing is, is it's very easy to work with, okay? It's got a bite ring and a seal, right? And if you want to take the coupler off of the duct, all you need to do is go uh, grab the ring on the outside and press in, and it comes right out which is very, very nice. Our microfit couplers come in a five millimeter all the way up to an 18 millimeter. And that pull force, um, a five millimeter is gonna require, tiny little five millimeter is gonna require a one, about a pound and a pound and a half of pressure to be able to pull that apart. Meanwhile, on the 18 millimeter uh, coupler, you're using 123 pounds of pressure to separate it. So these aren't gonna come off for you in the field. We wanted to, we wanted to do something different for our outdoor applications. Okay, so what we did was we came up with a direct berry coupler. Now, this is, uh, this is a push fit. You, if you unscrew it, it's not going to make the, the, the duct go in any easier. And if you push the duct in and you tighten it up, it doesn't seal it any better. Okay, it is a push fit. What you find with this is it's a lot more like our traditional comfit couplers in its build, right? 
So we push the coupler in and we try and pull it apart. Can't do that. Again, the pull force on these in seven millimeters, you're looking at 67 pounds of pressure at seven millimeters. And at, tw at the 20 millimeter coupler, you're looking at, at 221 pounds of pull force in order to be able to get that to separate. Again, if these are going into the ground, they're not coming off. And that was important, okay? But when we take this apart, we're gonna see that it has a traditional bite ring to it. The coupler itself is fully plastic. So there's not gonna be any degrading of the coupler. It's gonna hold up really, really well over time, okay? And like I said, it's got a traditional bite ring, a lot like our Comfit couplers. And if you look, and if you look here, we've got a separator, just like our Comfit, and then we've got a traditional rubber seal inside of it as well. So when you push this in, when you're pushing this in, it's not like the Comfit couplers as much where you have to push it twice. It is generally small enough that, um, it is generally small enough that you push this in all in one take. It does have a clear center to it. And while you're, you are not going to push the duct all the way to the middle of the coupler, you will be able to push it in far enough for you to be able to look and see if that coupler is in place or if the, if the duct is in place or not. Okay, so micro fit, more for an indoor application. It still gets used outdoors but it's more designed for an indoor application. Our, uh, our, our direct berry couplers, designed for outdoor applications. Again, they both hold 230 PSI. So if you're blowing in fiber with these, they're gonna be able to hold up to whatever you can throw at them. Well, we've talked about our Comfit couplers, our direct fits, and our micro fit couplers. I hope you've learned a little bit more about our couplers today, and I hope you have a great day. Thank you.